In this video, we will learn how to make a blog post using GetShop Today platform. First of all, you need to see if you have activated the blogging option or not. To check it out, you can go to Settings and then General Settings. When there, you can see the blog option. If this button is not set to Yes, you will not be able to find the blog functionality. So make sure this button is switched on. You can find the blog functionality in your content management section. As you can see, the blog option is here. When you are in the blog area, you can see two existing blogs displayed here already. Now, if you simply click on the new blog post, it will allow you to write the blog title. Also, you can choose the category here, write meta keywords and meta description here. First of all, you can see here an option called blog title. Simply write your blog title here and now enter the blog content. You need to click on add featured blog image where you can add any image you want. Click on open. When you have chosen the image, simply crop it and then click on crop blog image. Finally, click on add blog and the blog post will be added. Also, here is an option called use builder. If you click on use builder, the system will present you with much more sophisticated design tools. If you know how to use the GetShop Today Builder function, then you can create a beautiful design for your blog. But if you do not want to spend a lot of time to design a blog, you can simply click on Add Blog Post. When you click on Add Blog Post, the system will publish your post and inform you that the blog was added successfully. Now, if you go to the content management area and click on the blog, you can see that this demo blog post that we just created has been added. But it is still not shown in the front end because for the time being, it is inactive. If you click on this button called inactive, it will become active. Now, let's go to the front end and see how this blog post appears. If you click on the menu, you can then choose news. In this specific theme, the blog posts are called news. That means you have an option to decide how you want to call this blog post area. You can call it news and events. You can call it simply blog or any other name that you choose. So now let's click on the news. Your recent blog post, this one, is here. Also, here is the category you selected. And now if we click on detail, we will be able to see the full page. Also, we can write comments. And here you can see the share button. If someone wants to share the blog post on Facebook or Twitter, they can share it with just one click. Also, you can see here the filter. If someone wants to navigate from here to some other blog post, they can do this from here. This is how it looks like in the front end, but sometimes you may experience that in the menu, there is no such link called blog or news or news and events. None of them are there. Sometimes it may happen that your blog is activated in the general settings here, but still the blog does not appear here in the menu. The reason for this is that a particular menu item is not activated in the menu link settings area. So let's go back to the menu link settings again. First, go to content management, then to the drop down option menu link settings, then press on this button menu links settings. After that, here you can see an option to activate or inactivate a menu link. If it is inactivated, it will look like this. In this case, you can find this inactivated link here in the inactive menu list. If you click on the inactive menu list, then here, you can see that the news menu item is here. So all you have to do is click on the button inactive to reverse it and make it active. Also, if you want to rename this particular menu item and call it news and events, for example, you can click on edit icon and then change it here to news and events and update. Now again, go back to the inactive menu list and simply click here to activate. Now you will see this button here. And if you refresh and click on the menu again, you can see that this button appears now as news and events. And this is how you can make a blog post and manage your blog in GetShop Today website. Thank you for watching.